check, my check. One, two, three, my check, my check. OBS, please do not die on me. It actually looks like it's been pretty stable. <laughs> Second graphics card is not running too hot with regard to running OBS itself, while 1080, my main graphics card goes ahead and takes care of the video and the avatars. I'm running two different programs for the avatar, no less. Let us go announce. <clears throat> ENV tuber. ENV tuber uprising. There we go. Hey, Perakud. How are you today? I have not exactly decided what I want to do today. I don't think I'm going to be continuing Needy's Streamer Overdose. Not because I don't like the game, but because I've played it so far for the past two streams. And we got that uh, not bad, not good ending. I'm not sure if there's much benefit or it would be very entertaining to continue playing it until I get all the endings, or at least getting a million subs, because, well, that might take God knows how long, and you're going to be pretty much seeing the same thing over and over and over again. I guess it's only been two streams, so maybe I'm being too hard on myself. Maybe it would work out anyway. Oh, by the way, we got new emojis this time. Courtesy of Steel, they have recently made and allowed me to upload this emoji. Which is... Lulz... Why is it not letting me... You had a chill day? Oh, you're about to sleep? I always catch you right as you're about to sleep. <laughs> Thank you for stopping by to say hello anyway. I always appreciate that, even if you don't end up staying sticking around that long. Always appreciate it. How do I get out of here? There we go. Springpaw! Thanks for stopping by up. Thank you for resubscribing. Hey, Lenarth. Thank you all for stopping by anyway, even though you'll all have to be going to bed soon. I, will, As always, I'll of course be able to find y'all on Saturday. We'll be streaming at the regular time. Oh, that reminds me. My next collab is going to be playing Crab Game. That's going to be on Sunday. At 5.30 p.m. Central Time, which is 17.30 Central Time here, CST. 
I'll be sure to remind everyone about that on this Saturday stream. We'll have another chill stream on Saturday morning, my time, which should be afternoon, you guys' this time, something like that. Mm-hmm, Saturday hype. Before you all go, how was your day? Uh, Perica told me that their day was relatively chill. What about you, Spring Ball, and what about you, Lenarth? Mm-hmm. Lenarth, uh, spring Paul, dead tired, all Lenarth, stressful and annoying day, been on a task at work for far too long, and it's getting problematic, been troubleshooting for the past days with my boss, and no success so far, ah, oh, fuck, I hate corporate bureaucracy, so I know that feel, spring Paul, haven't walked anywhere in ages, but now I gotta, um, where are you walking to you, if I may ask? I can't walk or drive anyway because there is literally about a foot of snow outside my door that I can see from my window. <laughs> I posted some pictures in the Discord. There's actually more snow now than there was when I took a photo this morning. I'm gonna take another picture, in fact. Do -do -do. Oh, walk to work, you mean? So, I think I asked you this when I was watching one of your streams earlier. You mentioned something about um, driving. Do you just not drive, or is it like next door, so you can just head over? Or oh god, I didn't real—I didn't know if you were being like serious, you're being joking about that, or what? Because at least here in the states, it's kind of like an American thing where everyone is kind of mandated to drive because that's the only way to get anywhere around here. But we do have people that, for one reason or another, can't pass the exams or refuse to take them, so. If they're lucky, they live in a place with de with some mass transit anyway, but. That sucks. Um, were you working from home before or something? It, because it's sick. the way you worded it, it makes it sound like you weren't doing any of that walking before, before recently. Beep, boop, boop. Is my mouth just staying open the whole time that I'm talking? Oh. Why is it doing that? Hmm. One second. Oh, the office was closed the whole time. <clears throat> So you didn't have like work from home or anything? Start. Let's see how it looks now. Uh, la 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 la. La, 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 la. Man, three frames makes a lot of difference. I drop, bring it up to 27, and it's tracking my lip movements perfectly now. That's weird. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, I was work from home. Oh, so they're sending you back to the office. I'm sorry to hear that. It's a shame they're not letting you just stay at home. Some people, I guess, just lucked out. Like myself. <laughs> So I guess um, the COVID situation is kind of stabilized up there in uh, the UK. If you don't mind me asking. Mm hmm.
Part of the reason I was hoping to get some people's opinions on what I should play for this stream session is because I'm kind of conflicted. Oh, it's just been relaxed restrictions. Okay, well, that's still decent. I've been, I decided to take a gamble and, oh, numbers are still high, huh? Why are they sending you back, back to work then? That's dumb. Well, I hope you stay safe, all right? <laughs> so, I decided to take a gamble and try out this game here, uh, Zenith, The Last City. And I didn't expect it an MMO, the MMO to honestly be this good for what it is. I mean, by MMO standards, it's very basic, very simple. But by the fact that I'm in virtual reality playing a MMORPG with other people and everyone can just group up and help each other and hang out like on a whim was kind of ridiculous. I mean, I said I was gushing about this in the Discord last night, but one of the first mechanics the game teaches you is literally to climb, right? It's to literally go to a pillar, and you have to, like, literally grab on to grab onto the pillar. And you have to, and you have to, like, hold on to the pillar, and you literally have to pull yourself up. My arms are actually sore right now, and I was wondering why, because I didn't do that many arm exercises during the virtual reality uh, work or gym, gymnasium that I went to. But it's, and I realize it's because you have to hold your arms out to fly in the game, and you have to physically grab hold onto and pull yourself up with your arms in the game. Because that's like, because that's a core mechanic. You have to do a lot of climbing in the game. And I just thought to myself, like, wow, this is kind of wild. There was a group of Korean players who were there too, who were also trying to work their way through the tutorial missions, and they got confused in the climbing section. They were like, they thought it was a prompt, like most people would, right? They thought you just had to go in there and click something and you would attach to the wall or whatever. But no, you have to physically grab onto the wall and pull yourself up. So I was showing them how that works, because I, I climbed all the way up and then stood grabbed onto this ledge and then pull myself onto the ledge and you stand on the ledge so you can like crouch down and like wave at people and like talk to them and stuff there also seems to be no like um maximum or maybe there is a maximum i just didn't notice it but i noticed that i was able to i chose a mage or something as a starting class and when i fired them because you get two pistols type things they seem to go across the map. I could snipe enemies with this and just keep shooting them until before they can reach me and they would die. Yeah, pretty much Mula movie stuff. <laughs> so that was so cool. And when we finally got into the lush overworld and started hanging out with people, it was amazing. Everyone was just like wild and friendly and like talking about the game. Some people were even streaming the game as they were playing it. I would have to pull out all my VR stuff and um, set that up though, and I don't waste too much time on that. I um, have been meaning to stream VR again, but it is it does. I take really good care of my index and other VR centric devices, so I kind of really anal about keeping them away and putting them away and stuff. Oh, it's really cool! And oh my god, um, so the pistol thing was cool, but also the game is like. You can cast magic spells by doing certain hand motions, and I'm like, "Are you fucking? Are you fucking serious?" And sure enough, when you went to go to get to like level two or level three, it's like you gain thunder, like the Pokemon move. And in order to do that, you have to like, you make you form a fist with your hand, right? And you bring it down slowly, and you feel the controller shape vibrating, and you see your hand glow, and then you aim the uh, reticle on someone. It's on the ground, and you when you release your hand, it fires this fuck huge bolt of lightning. It goes from the goes from the sky, right? And the best part is, 
you can do it with both hands, baby. So I just kept spamming that, and it's worked so well that I kind of accidentally set it off a little, or set it off by accident a lot of times because my natural tendency, even though you don't need to do it with the index controllers, is to uh, keep gripping them, holding them down. So in the midst of combat, you'd be like shooting someone, shooting a mob, a mook with one hand, right, with one pistol, because you get two pistols. And then you would like charge a thunder attack with the other pistol, and then you would like jump back and release the thunder on their face, which staggers them. And then you'd either charge your pistols and keep shooting them, or you would. The next spell that I learned was a fireball spell, and I thought it was a charge spell too, but it's actually this like you have you physically there's a fireball that's in your inventory the whole time, that has on a cooldown. So what you have to do is you have to physically grab the fireball, and then you have to throw it. And you could miss with it, because you're physically throwing a ball of fire. <laughs> it's like a grenade. So, like, sometimes I would, like, throw it, and I would miss, and, I would, and then I would, cur and I would scream, and I'd have to fucking either shoot the enemy with my other pistol and hope that it's... Oh my god, we're being raided again, and I just started. Hey, zombie. <clears throat> Thanks for the second raid. Mary Ann, thank you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome, everyone to lol's chat we're on lol's chat right now because i have not decided on what we're going to stream today i kind of i was kind of uh, put off by the ending of uh, needy streamer overdose um thank you so much for the follow mary much appreciated and i was just telling my followers about um this um, this uh defer i'm not sure it's the first ever but Definitely the most successful early access virtual reality MMO RPG called Zenith MMO. Um, I first found out about this game a few years ago on Kickstarter, and um, despite being an avid Kickstarter backer myself, to me this game just kind of screamed scam city. And now I'm eating uh, humble pie because it's out on Steam. It's twenty five bucks. It works. <laughs> I was playing it last night on, in my, on my index, and I was just telling them about how the combat works, and it is... The game, if you were to remove the virtual reality aspect, the MMO is, at the moment, nothing too special. Uh, go to quest marker, talk to person, they give you a quest to go kill a bunch of mooks, you go over to the quest, you have to kill the mooks. But what makes this fun so far is the fact that you can. They they keep saying in their PR stuff that they want to try and make the game as to emphasize the social nature of of MMORPGs, and it really feels like that so far. I mean, starting off from the fact that in order to accept quest uh, requests, you go up to a quest giver who has a big exclamation point over their head, and you have to wave at them, right? And if you wave at them long enough, then they start talking to you, and then they give you the quest. Also, anytime you're out in the over overworld, it's not like other MMOs where you select a mob and you're locked into fighting that and mo usually people can't join in. Um, any mob can attack you at any time and you and any player can join in and help out other party members at any time. And half the time of the game, I would be getting, either myself or other people would be getting absolutely mobbed rushed by goblins or some shit. And you would always have these people that are just start running in, swinging swords, or like firing fucking laser beams and magic and shit all over the place. Um, because there's no, there's, there's no real downside to helping people in this game. As far as I could see, when you join and help kill an enemy, you always get experience and you always get mats from it. Which was a huge quality of life improvement over other MMOs. Yeah, it is epic. That's why I'm geeking out about it right now. And I was just telling my followers about how the uh, combat system works for at least mages, of how you have to like do hand movements to cast spells, and how you have to. One of the spells is a fireball, and you have to throw the fireball, and you it's like you actually have to physically throw it. <laughs> and I didn't realize how sensitive it was at first, and I was testing the sensitivity out. So the first few times I actually missed. It's like throwing a grenade, and then there's one time where. I noticed that you can shoot and attack enemies from pretty far away in this game, like sniper shot style. So I took a grenade and just did a fucking baseball pitch, and I beamed a cobbler in the head with it from like far away, and he just starts running after me. 
uh, too far away to actually reach me though before I just like get the guns and just start blasting. And just stuff like that. I'm so enthralled by how, how much they managed to get done with this game. And it's only early access. So even though there's, there's obviously some obvious bugs, like sometimes you still get stuck on wall geometry and stuff like that. But if this is how good a VR MMO is right now, I can't wait for like five years down the line when the technology matures further or even seeing where this game goes. Because, I mean, I wrote this off as another Kickstarter scam and it turned out to not be a Kickstarter scam. It turns out they pretty much followed through with their promises. I mean, even it looks like it switched genres a little bit. They said it was going to be a cyberpunk MMO and it's clearly more uh cyber fantasy because you start off in this undercity of this big uh cyberpunk 77 <clears throat> uh, overworld with like neon advertisements everywhere and you got the uh fucking bridges and these huge skyscrapers and you take an elevator all the way up top and then you see more of that but you're on the top floor now and you could leave the city and go in this big fantasy overworld with um people with swords and shields and like mobs and like firing magic missiles at you. And I'm only level four. I haven't really gone that far in the game. I spent much, much of the early game exploring the immediate surroundings, dying, and shitposting, basically. Because a lot, of, and because I mean, I know this will probably change in the future. I mean, you always meet shitty people online. It's just a fact of life and fact of being online. But at least, maybe, if, at least at first, everyone seemed equally enamored with just the fact that, bro, it's fucking Swords Art Online. Or, in my generation, uh, bro, we're in Dot Hack Sign. <laughs> and other gay, uh, you know, MMO likes, virtual reality likes. Um, I have yet to die in real life, thankfully, from as many times as I've died in Zenith. And I was thinking, I was wondering if I should stream that today. Unfortunately, um, I would need to do some setup, so it would probably take away some precious time from the actual streaming to do so. I might stream it maybe Saturday, maybe next week. Who knows? We'll figure it out. Uh, but that's enough gushing about Zenith for now. I actually did write a review for Zenith, which I'm which I posted on Twitter. You'll see a, if you see a huge wall of text. That's what. That's what that is. Um, but aside from that, um, dead virgin found. <laughs> God rest their soul. I was really hoping to get back into Metal Unit. I did say I was hoping to finish Metal Unit eventually. I technically finished Needy Streamer Overdose and um, went through most of the plot points. The only things I've not done is gone the... Uh, ending where you actually win and you get a million viewers i got seven hundred thousand. i know near the end of the last stream uh, it looked like i was going to try and go for it but yeah i think at this time it'd be better to just finish that on my own time maybe talk about the ending later i really like besides the parts i liked best about that were not the vis necessarily the visuals and the animations and the music but the really good, in my opinion, the great writing and the great localization. Uh, 4chan in that game definitely did sound like 4chan. And it really did give me uh, VTuber vibes. There's even one point in the game where one of your commenters actually refers to you. Uh, not not you, but Amy. Um, K-Angel. K-Angel as a MeTuber, which is a not-so-subtle reference to VTubers. I mean, they even rhyme, right? But I digress. Let's go ahead and play video games. Let's us go and pop on... Oh, and I uh, want to do a short plug here. So this is a kind of uh, quirky cyberpunk visual novel. And I kind of did a double take because it appears that the head developer of this game um, followed me on Twitter. And I don't know why or how. The only thing I could think of is that they read me talking about VR chat and decided to follow. I I was kind of shocked. <laughs> like, okay, that's cool. 
I kind of feel bad that I didn't get the I didn't get around to playing this game yet, but um, Ace did suggest that I try playing this on stream. I am supposed to be a cyberpunk VTuber anyway, cyberpunkish VTuber, so I might get around to doing that sometime. We'll do that. And Perkwood, what did you say? It took me twelve hours to get a good ending. Are you sure? Yeah. Um, it took you twelve hours. I mean, did you just, just we keep replaying the uh, days? I mean. I'm not against doing so, I just wasn't sure if anyone would want to see that. I mean, I guess it's not too different from grinding uh, weapons and skill points and metal units. You're pretty much replaying the same thing over and over again. Yeah, fuck it. We'll do it live. We'll go ahead and try to beat Needy Streamer. See, we're going to, I think we'll at least play it until we get one of the uh, endings with the million followers. Just one. Do, do, do. <clears throat> mm hmm. Game capture to Windows. I need to do something about making it so that you guys can actually see that so that the chat's actually readable while playing this game because right now it's not readable, not with the uh, color scheme, not with this bright blueness. I wonder if I can like, hmm, let's do filters. Let's do... what's this button do? That's audio filter. Let's try effect filter. Image mask? Uh... I don't know what this does. Kinda afraid to see what it does. That did not seem to do anything. Filter. Image mask blend. I'll pass the stretch image. Um, hmm. Alpha mask, alpha channel, subtraction. Does that do anything? Nope. I'll probably need to figure this out later. In the meanwhile, let's go ahead and get rid of that filter in case it messes something up. Maybe what I can do instead... ...is... Steel, you've come just in time. I kind of wish that you were here when I was gushing about Zenith, because I don't... I think I'm going to do a gush like that again, at least not on stream. Maybe I'll do it in Discord. But thank you so much. I always appreciate your hugs. <laughs> um, I was just trying to figure out how do I... What can I do to this to make it so it's easier to see? Oh! Hmm. Custom color. That also did nothing. I don't know why I did that. Oh my god. I'm sure you would. But anyway. Also. Guess you gotta eventually make some background for the chat. Yeah. I've been playing with the idea of maybe I should just get a layout but I don't know I kind of like not having a layout list chat means that I could just make a box and make the chat look a little bit smaller <clears throat> or what I could do no it's not gonna work either uh, or maybe it would is
Oh Christ, that is horrible to look at. Just fucking can't read anything. I mean, I know the solution to this, but I'm... Uh, I'm gonna have to fem boy up and do it anyway. I know what the solution to this is. Let's go to cap chat. Let's go to night dev cap chat. Uh, is to do this. Go to cat chat. Lol's time. Show the bots. And then we're gonna use the chat theme. Something that's actually readable with this extreme coloration. Copy that. I'm gonna go to OBS. I'm going to go to CapChat properties, and then here we go. I'm gonna wait for it to load a little bit. There we go. And I'm probably going to. Oh, damn. Okay, so what we'll need to do instead is... Sacrifices must be made for the greater good. We'll try it like this for now. Especially since I could just move stuff on the computer screen itself. Love forever. Go tonight. So we're on day 24. I wonder if it, would be, if it would be possible to reach from here. I'm at affection 99 too, so it's like... But stress is so high up there. Like, I'm not sure. I don't think I could even... I guess we're not streaming today. It's nighttime, but hmm. Like, <clears throat> for whatever reason, it's actually not letting me stream tonight. So my only options are to find a way to reduce her stress. Wait, it's possible to go for a hundred affection. I wonder what happens if you do that. Man, her mental darkness is going to go through the roof. <clears throat> Stops, coughs, makes you feel all sorts of things. What if you do that? Yeah. I guess the only thing you can really do is sleep until tomorrow. Because I need to reduce that stress like crazy. Also, but you know video streaming until tomorrow does the same thing does about the same amount of same amount. I know that at some point it's possible to overdose and one of the bad endings is probably to <clears throat> accidentally OD her, which I don't want to do. I don't play these games to unlock all the endings, believe it or not. I play these games to try and get the best ending in the first run, which, or at least a ending that's not going to make me depressed. And um, obviously we are far beyond that at this point. Knowing there's only six days left, though. I guess it's not the worst thing. Dinder? We could also just go in Dinder. Should help to reduce the affection issues. I think I might have been abusing Dinder too much, though, so I might get a Dinder ending or something 
something horrifying might happen in one of these Dinder dates. It's kind of dark that right after meeting your meeting her parents, you end up going to on a Dinder date that very evening. That wasn't so bad though. fuck is happening what the fuck is happening This hits uh this this hits too hard. I, I I can't do this. <clears throat> Sorry, Chad. Um, I, um, I'm this actually this uh, um this is too much. Uh, fucking trigger warnings. This, shit, this damn. Like, is there? Can I just? Can I not? What the fuck is this? Like... Can I please not? And not gonna lie, I'm actually kind of upset with the game right now. <laughs> It's not the game's fault. I mean, I did just go go off saying that this game probably emulates the VTuber life a, the, a little too closely. The social commentary so far has been pretty good. I just didn't. I didn't expect this. Uh, this is this is a kind of a bit much even for me. Um, for uh, reasons. Um, but at the same time, I'm really tempted to see where the. Tell you what. Oh, fuck off. Are you kidding me? It's going to be like that. Sorry, I I don't want to play that. And uh, I don't really want to play it on stream either. Um, let's hope RNG doesn't do that again. Well, we're starting on D25 again, so, you know. Uh... We're not playing Needy Street and Overdose today, alright? I'm sorry. <laughs> Just, yes, we're not playing that today. Um, let's play Metal Unit. Man, I don't actually remember the last time I got triggered by a video game. I'm not even mad at the game itself, it's just that I'm a little too close to the game and realizing that the game's having you, like, em fucking emulating cutting yourself, I just... That's too much. That's, that's way too much. 
I mean, if I do finish it, I'll finish it in my own time. I'm not going to... I don't, this is not the sort of thing that I want to do in public. There, there's just some things that you don't broadcast, and I'm kind of, I kind of have a sore spot for uh, influencers who broadcast serious shit like that on public. It's, it's not right. It's, it's just not right. So, um, I mean, it's, just, it's just not right. Steam is kind of lagging now. I've tried to load up Melly. <laughs> And you know, this is the. There's a lot of visual novels that I only ever play once and I don't play again. And the reason I do is because. I know that in order to reach those other endings, you have to play a different way. You have to do things that. Um, against what you, the person, would have done. I'll give you an example um, Knights of the Old Republic, my favorite RPG of all time, Star Wars, BioWare. Has a lot of choices, right? Um, now, people make fun of the playing as the bad guys in Knights of the Old Republic all the time because a lot of the choices are very cartoonish, right? Um, it, you, you don't really feel as bad for doing them because they're so cartoony that it takes you out of the character. Some of them are not like that. Some of the choices in Knights of the Old Republic, they really, the game really makes you feel like, wow, you're a dick. As intended. I mean, to get the worst possible ending with... I don't want to spoil the game, but there are some, there are some choices in the game where it's comical, it's funny, it's not... You can't take it seriously, you're basically being a comic book villain. And there are some choices in the Knights of the Old Republic that you really have to be a dick and the game will not stop to pretty much really grind in that, wow, you are an asshole. A lot of vision levels are like that too. In order to get all the endings of the game, you really need to go leaps and bounds. And that's why I don't like finishing a lot of vision levels to completion. I'm not a completionist in that sense. I don't want to... It sounds weird, right? Because I'm a VTuber. I I don't look like anything like this in real Okay, breaking the illusion for a little bit. Unfortunately, I don't look like this in real life. Gee, yeah, huge surprise. But I always really feel like one of the main points of the internet is that you get to be something you cannot be in the real world. Well, when it comes to role-playing games, I very rarely like to be a terrible person. I always feel that with presented the opportunity to think about your decisions and to reload saves, I would much rather do the things that are the best possible things, the good things, if presented with a situation. Because in real life, I say that I want to, and a lot of people do this, we all say we want to be great people, good people, good persons. Human, human emotions and humanity being what it is, more often than not, we can't do that effectively. Because it's not very easy to stop and think about things see the future, stuff like that. You can't just reload a save. And you know what? Excuse me, I'm getting a little emotional here. If presented with the opportunity, I would never, ever, intentionally lead someone, much less someone you're supposed to care about, to self-destructive behavior. It's just... Yeah, it's, it's funny, I actually, I haven't even played, I haven't played the DLC. The internet spoiled me on that, and I'm not sure if I ever could, it's just, like, I mean. I, I don't. Let's play some Metal Unit. Give me a second, I'll, I'll be right back.
Sorry. Um, had to clean up a little bit there. To calm down a little bit. It's been a long time since the video game has made me that emotional. Really, I, I didn't plan this shit. I, I didn't mean for any of that to happen on stream. There's a lot to say. There's a lot to be said about typing up emotions and exaggerating stuff on stream, but now I'm... I don't think I would like to play any additional needy streamer overdose on this stream. I, I'll, I'll think about it, but that was too much and it's not right, dude. Yeah, well, it's just, if you love someone, you would not even let them get to that position to begin with. Um, I haven't played this game in forever. <laughs> it's been like, it feels like forever since I've played Metal Unit. Did I, did I, um, update the uh, stream channel? There we go. Okay. Okay. Um... Oh yeah, I got the chainsaw and the golden gun. Um, yeah, I need to. <laughs> I hope I didn't forget how to play this game. Shit. <laughs> uh, let's see, slide dash. Da -da -da -da. I wonder if the chainsaw does anything aside from looking cool. Or the emperor. I know I was trying to grind out these legendary things so I can eventually get the uh, golden weaponry again. So, eh, doesn't hurt to continue in that. We could try new weapons, see what they're like, what's like. I'm kind of pissed that the rapier is considered a short range weapon because if you've seen these in real life, they're not short range. Steel Perquid Leonard, thank you so much uh, for the support i i really appreciate it I, I apologize for like i'm having a minor breakdown on stream just now it's just i mean it is what it is i guess it, it's shit but i don't know so we're gonna go through here as once again and grab some of these weapons to use and hopefully uh use up the get the mastery points for it I mastered all of the ultimate skills, add-ons, add-ons, add-ons. A Scud Missile? Scud Missiles are so huge. Did they miniaturize that or something? Accessory. Um, I think I... Oh. So somehow I've not done Lightning Boots yet. Lightning Shoes. That sound effect makes it sound like this is the first time I picked this up. I guess I technically have... What's this one? Why is this E? Hmm. Must be a glitch. It's been so long since I've seen our anime waifu. Do I have hiccups? Oh shit, I have hiccups. Shit, shit, shit. T, save me. Uh, Spearmint and Moringa. <sighs> P, 
feels good, man. Good feels, good feels all around. Have a good night, Le good night, Lenarth. Love you too. Hope to see you again soon this week. We got three more streaming days going on. Anyway, let us go on to inventory. <clears throat> go on to equip. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this pistol. Oh, I see it's a little bit longer range than a dagger, but still stupidly short range, in my opinion. Why is E blanked out, though? Oh! E is the giant blade. I need to swap that out as well, though. Well, hmm. Actually, do we need to swap it out? Let's keep the super particle can. And I died last time, so I don't have anything in my inventory. We'll need to grind a little bit to level up some stuff, because... I don't think we're done yet. Permanently increased speed. Increased healing from HP pots. Smudge detected, apparently, on my Leap Motion controller. So we're gonna clean that really quick. Hey Ace! How are you tonight? Oh, shit. God damn it. Forgot to announce. Thank you for reminding me. All right, we have been announced and we are live. Sorry about that, everyone. Hey, Flan, how are you? It is Wednesday, indeed. Um, I'm doing okay, Ace. I was originally, I was talk, I was gushing, I was talking. We got raided really early on by Zombie. Thank you once again for the raid, Zombie. And I was basically gushing about Zenith and talking about my plan for about future streamable material. Hey, Seal! Thanks for coming by as well. And um, we decided... I was th saying that I kind of don't want to play Needy Girl Overdose anymore because I thought it was kind of a grind to get all the other endings. And I didn't know if anyone wanted to read that or to watch that. But then Perakod was, uh, was like, "Oh, it only takes around, it only took me twelve hours to finish it. You could probably finish it by then." And I'm like, "Okay." So I started it up again, and then, um, um, I couldn't. Um, I reduced the stress level of Amy. But then, this is already spoiled for this stream, so I'm just gonna say it. What happens? All right. The very next day, she the stress meant went made her go ballistic, and she started cutting herself, and it became a mini game, and there was no way out of it except to reload the save, and there's no and when I reloaded it, it reloaded on day twenty five, and it happened again, and it just lets you do that. There's no option to not cut Amy. She said she presents to you her arm and you have to play this mini game where it brings a bar up and down and you have to push this button which makes you cut her and I I just couldn't. I, I it's not all it's not often that I 
get triggered by anything, okay? I don't remember even remember the last time I got so upset at a video game. I still I don't take back anything I said about PD Streamer Overdose being a great game, a great social commentary. And this situation unfortunately says a lot about that social commentary, but um I What in the world was that noise just now? Oh, well, thanks. I could use a sandwich. How did you know that that was one of the options? Um, num, 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 of reasons that are not directly related to the game and just like um you, you know how there's people that they're completionists and they play these games to completion right i never play vision novels to completion because doing so means you need to choose options that you yourself would never have you never would because you're not a prick and well I, I have really strong feelings when it comes to stuff like mental health and like in real life I would have never had someone be like hey just fucking take all these fucking pills or hey um I mean I don't know um suicide self-harm this is if it's not obvious um I do have some history that I'm not gonna discuss and it's a very sensitive topic for me. So I decide that if I do finish playing the game, I'm going to probably finish it in my own time. I might change my mind on Friday, who fucking knows, but I just need to play something that's not needy, needy stream or overdose right now. And besides, uh, I want to see if we can actually get past the lava stage today, see how far we can get in this game. It's been a while since I played Metal Unit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean... Oh, there are other options down here. It's quite clear that the devs intended... chose all these decisions in order to evoke, you know, a strong response from the player. Because, as someone pointed out in chat, if it wasn't able to do that, it kind of failed in its purpose. And... Admittedly, as someone who also writes really heavy themes in his own fiction, I feel that sometimes it is necessary to be harsh to get across a point. And that's why I keep reiterating I'm not mad at the game. I'm not going to quit the game forever or anything. I'm just upset because it hits. It hits a very. a actual sensitive part in myself that I was not expecting and I very rarely get feel these kind of emotions this kind of reaction to video games yeah oh it's quite obvious I need a bit a bit of the break and I mean only some of you know this because I've talked to you about in private but you probably can tell that there's another reason why I'm upset. You know, uh... I need to read back in comments, because the comments spot, the comments window in uh, OBS is smaller, uh, default to the original size, so it's a lot smaller. Uh, so I, so if I miss anyone, I, uh, my apologies, I need to, I need to back read really quick. Um... Okay, I caught up. Uh, 
I was talking about that, yeah. I was... I really want to stream Zenith... Um, our Zenith MMO here. I was thinking about doing it today, but I would need to set up everything, and I put everything away, because I'm really anal about keeping my VR equipment in pristine... Uh, pristine condition. So, I was wondering if anyone would like to see that... Maybe... Friday? I mean, I could take the take the time to set up things right now. I just concerned about wasting stream time setting up the thing, and I don't know how it's going to you know interact with Twitch and all that good shit. Okay. For this Friday, then, we're going to... I'm going to stream Zenith MMO. We'll play around there. If we have time, we'll hang out in VR chat or do other cool shit in VR. Since I finally learned how to use the almighty streamer camera in VR chat... I don't have a model in VR chat yet, though. I still need to upload one. That'd be cool. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, let me just, uh... oh, Ace, another update. So I found out, I messed around with my stream settings and I found out a few things. First off, um, it turns out with my internet, I can afford to stream at a higher bit rate. So I actually pumped up the bit rate to 8,000 bit or bytes, bits, kilobytes a second, something like that. Also, I found out that you can, in fact, encode with a separate graphics card. So, I fucked around with the settings, and I f was able to get my 980 Ti to encode while my 1080 Ti does the VR VTuber avatar and, um, and, and uh, the video game. So far, it's pretty stable. I've been streaming for the past hour and not have any major issues. I mean, even, even my avatar right here actually is fairly, fairly, doing fairly well, all things considered. Based and red. Flan, you have a great idea. Maybe I should just make Fridays VR Fridays. I'm kind of chasing after my uh, idol and uh, pseudo mentor Fia. We don't actually know each other in real life. I just consume all of her uh, tutorials. <laughs> but um, I've been wanting to break into VR, into more VR related content anyway. So that's a good idea. I should make Fridays be for VR stuff. Lol's tech tips. <laughs> Welcome to Lol's tech tips. <laughs> yeah, I love OBS. Also, um, I wonder since the since uh, the game is uh, metal units typically a lot darker, if I can afford to switch back to the translucent uh, chat box. Then again, I guess you guys don't really need to see the bottom left, right? Or no, better, better yet, better yet, um, um. No, bad, bad. That's not what I wanted to choose. Okay. There we go. Have it up there. Hmm. Who wanted me to give them a child? Steel, do you work on Fridays? I mean, well, actually, why did I ask that? That's a dumb question. Um, what what makes you think you're gonna miss going on dates with me? <laughs> so, what do you guys think of the uh, chat box? you think it's a good position? I could go on a... I could try planning a VR date with viewers. That would be fun. <laughs> Should I move the chat box anywhere? Do you think this is good? Is it obscuring too much? What? what? What do you think? What do you think? Okay. Switch it back to translucent. I can do that for you. One second. It's very easy to change this, so no big deal. I do have to go to physically go to the website to do so, though. Because what I'm doing, I'm not using any inbuilt things. I'm using a uh, cap chat, which uh, you have to get a link for it. What's wrong? 
Uh, no one's given Flan a gift yet. Nope. Oh, you have a weekly card to mint on Fridays. Shit. Hmm. Well, well, we'll work it out, Steel. Just because I said I'll be doing it on Fridays doesn't mean that I'm only going to do it on Fridays. Thank you for giving Flan a sub. Much appreciates. Oh, by the way, I've uploaded the uh, second emoji made by Steel, so you can use that now. It's not letting me use it for whatever reason, but... It should be lols t... Uh, lols t... woke. Clear your browser cache or reload the page. How do I reload the stream chat from Twitch? Um, oh, I'm dumb. I could just push refresh. Hmm. <laughs> Lost the ah, uh, lost the woke is still broken. I wonder it's because when I uploaded, I think it was still saying, "Oh, it's pending in pending review or something, or pending being checked out by Twitch, or something like that." For some reason, they didn't like it, and I don't know why. Awesome, you can do emotes. Okay. So, I'll go to emotes, right? <clears throat> yeah, it still says here it's still in for review for some reason. Right there, that's a little pending approval. I wonder why. It's been a few days, too. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Without further ado, let's get roll. Let's uh, get rolling. It's not not safe for work though. That's the weird thing. I don't know why they think it is. Do I want hunter or do I want? I like this one. Okay. Let's get on to metal units. I got my ass kicking for Rusty the other day. Let's see if I can kick ass instead. Oh really? Superhuman strength, huh? I don't know anything about that. Why did it hit me even though I clearly hit it first? Oh, they explode! They're explo They're explosive, I see how it is. Always love gold. Can never have enough gold. Did I kill everything living here? Did I, I get did I get everything? Hmm. I'm not sure if I can even. Oh, it's one of these, huh? to go up I don't think I have a big enough fucking oh 
Okay. Never mind. Well, you got the butcher, but thank you anyway. I need to grind out these weapons here so I can get their mastery points. I remember this one, all right. Ah! It always gets me, even after many hours playing this game. Oh, shit. Did I forget how to play this game? I totally have. Ha! Ah, I still won, and I got the Raiden. The Raiden is actually really fucking good. It's actually... It's just... I forgot I had this. Gonna give it to my bot. See? Look at look at this. Oh my god, that's obscene. Tempest item acquired. I can hear the cries of the slimes. Knowing our luck, it's totally full of monsters everywhere. Huh? You can do a flying kick? Interesting. So is this like more like a martial arts? Um, martial arts slow down there? I think my other items may be a tad bit too powerful because they're killing things faster than I can gain mastery points with this. Pusheen is always a good investment. Give all mortal possessions to Pusheen. Who introduced you to the uh, Pusheen brand anyway? He can book him. He can book him. I has the power of gun on my hand. Yep, the really squishy cat. You know, Raiden might be a tad too strong, because it's killing everything before I can even get close. I'm only gonna unequip un that for now. Wait, what? Whoa, so that's how it works, huh? See ya, Flan. Have a nice shower. Get nice and clean. A war rake? This is interesting. Mm, do, do, do. Who's messaging me at this time?
Mushy Mushy, Los Days, Los Days. That was my dad. He was asking, how do you put two, how do you... Come to think of it, I was wondering why, I was wondering why he was asking me that question about how to make... How to put some documents into a file and then send it to our financial, our financial planner. So I was telling him about PDFs and he was like, how do you make a PDF? Which sounds funny, but then I realized I almost never have to make PDFs myself, so I'll actually have to research that. But anyway, back to metal units. We're doing pretty okay health-wise. Let's go see what other junk we can get, scrape up in the unknown. Mega Man Legend style. A lightning-filled lab. Let me just stretch my back really quick. There we go. Should I tell you, VR is good exercise, even if you're not actually doing a, v a uh, workout VR thing. Boom, boom, boom. Can I go up here? No. <laughs> Ow! Ow, shit. No! Bad. Bad droid. That's weird. I didn't need to actually... Hmm. That's weird. Got a purple box. Moonchild item. And this looks new too. Oh my goodness. Doesn't last very long though. Moon children. Can we? We can't really sell any of our stuff, can we? Guess not. I'm going to skew a little bit in a little bit closer. There we go. There we go. Raise the mic a little bit. There we go. I see you there. You're not very sneaky, Mr. Dinosaur. Ow! But you can shoot acid at me too, apparently. So I don't need to use the gun anymore. Can dump the gun. Or jump the gun. Whichever comes first. Can I, can I go out there? What the fuck was that? No! Bad exploding things. I'm doing terribly right now. Forgetting that you're supposed to dash to get out of stuff. Radioactive plushie. Ah. Daddy lols. <laughs> Ah! Eat shit, asshole. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Oh, shit. Did I not kill everything? No, I did not. I've used this rip here enough times. Give me the chainsaw. Daddy. <laughs> Gee, the aliens had ulterior motives. I would have never guessed that. 
from the subtext of the plot so far. I'm gonna die for my stupidity. No, I won't. Not yet, anyway. Once I complete this level, it's going to give me some health back anyway. Which is very comfy. See? 18 health. It's not much, but it's honest work. Sniper rifle item needs to be... trained up as well. Um, I much prefer if you don't call me daddy, please. Yeah! Boom, headshot. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Unless you're, you know, into that, of course. But even then, eh. Damn it! Epic, epic sniping skills save me. There we go. All as well as the Omnisai has intended. No! Shit! Fuck. Dead. <laughs> Is that a dragon? It's dead now. Hey, that's already been filled out, so I can switch to this now. Hmm. Take that, you greasy motherfucker. Wow. Oh, shit! I always do that. Okay. Boom, headshot. Wait! I almost forgot. Secret room. Thought so. Hey, look, health. And I also know what this place is. Wait. This is not the way. You know the way? I can't make that clicking noise that people do. Wait, everything is gone. What does this mean? Oh. The moon fire. Steep restricted area. I'll show you a steep area that's restricted. That 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 didn't, that 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 joke didn't hit well. Boom. 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 Ow. Killing Pokemons for fun and profit. Did you know that that FPS game that where you kill Pokemon has been DC has been perhaps to no one's surprise uh, DC or DMC8? I thought about checking it out, but I didn't think it'd be much more content than haha, look at us killing all these Pokemons. I hate to see it. What do you mean, hate to see it? <laughs> yeah, I thought it would be fun to stream. I mean, it wasn't gory or anything as far as you could tell. So I figured it'd be like a meme game or something. Ow. I'm not talking about the uh, 
I'm not talking about the game that's made by the same developers as the uh, Breath of the Wild ripoff. I'm talking about the um, an actual FPS game or of sorts. Hmm. Uh, knowing the internet, I'm sure we'll be able to find it somewhere. Eventually. Let's see what we could find here. Oh, is this a uh, level again? Can I not miss? For fuck's sake. Where's my no scoping app? There we go. I haven't really seen his claw or do anything yet. I wonder if I'm using it correctly. I didn't even know that they were... Spy spike trap! Ah! Ah! Did I reach mastery with a sniper rifle yet? Boom. Oh. Well, thanks for stopping by anyway, Steel. Have a good night. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Much hugs. Ciao. Ah! Bad. Boop. What will we find in the purple box? Brace your bets now. I actually like this weapon, panel missile. But I need to grind all these other things first, the war rake. Sure. Mm -hmm. I'll hit your DMs. Shh. Lies. Boom. Alright, sniper rifle is done. We can finally switch that out to something less shit. These are all shit. We're gonna use the golden gun. It's gonna take a while to use this one, looks like. Oh, melee attacks instantly kill enemies with low HP. Pew pew. My god, Steel, stop. <laughs> It to do. <laughs> is it being? Is am I actually gaining speed for this? Cool.
Nice try, Bucko. Bucky Opal, you're dead. Moonlight. Yes, you can. Thanks for the CC. I've actually never seen this missile before. Is this new? It is new. Fanatic missile. <clears throat> face tank? I actually don't know what face tank means. Nope, seriously, I don't, I don't know what face tank means. <laughs> Wait! Now I know what face tank means. It just occurred to me. That's basically when you pretty much press your face into an enemy and get injured and stuff, right? Or you just kind of boneheadedly attack an enemy face first, a full frontal. With dicks and balls out on full display. It's been a while since I heard that term. 98, I can finally get rid of this move. Standing directly in front of an enemy and take all of his attacks with a little effort to dodge, relying only on active healing or passive defenses to save you. So basically tanking. Wait, it has tank in the name. Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> Bitch. Oh my god, fanatic missiles. Get off me, what the fuck, why am I dying? Holy shit, I am dying. If I, I will refuse to die, well I got three potions anyway. Why can't I dash? Oh, great. There goes all my, all my potions. Oh, there's a wall here. They were shooting through the wall. I was wondering why I was just getting stuck there. Okay, that makes sense. That's mostly an MMO thing, right? I don't really play tanks in MMOs. I usually go DPS or uh, heals. Heal sliding. I feel like I become immune to a lot of shade being thrown at me when I'm doing something, just for just out of sheer ignorance of like not knowing what they're referring to. So ha, huh? I'm immune to your tactics now, Ace. You've inoculated and in, 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 inoculated me to them. <laughs> Don't be sad. I'm sure you'll find another way to test my buttons someday. <laughs> Ow. 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 
Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Another attack knife from the hunt courtesy of the hunter. Oh, snap. Oh, snap, what the fuck is this? I don't remember this section of the... Or do I? Pebble item acquired. Inventory is full of crap that you don't need. Discard. Sarah Shuri Sarah Shuri Kira. Still so many in I like the fact that despite getting all my weapons and stuff, you can still die in the first level if you're being careless. Which is what I've been this whole game so far. Exceedingly careless. Oh shit. Uh, yes, indeed. Lull's tech tips or Lull's tech tips shows everyone today how not to play metal unit. I say, as I sort of managed to survive that wave, despite Getting some serious close calls, isn't it? That, you know, this map went by really fast. We're already here. What the shit? Lightning blades. Purchase this as well. Ah, uh, Empire is full. Let's sell some shit. I actually don't like War Rake all that much. Don't really need this either. Uh, discard this. You already got the golden gun, a brass handgun. Uh gonna equip Falcon with that though. Let's see how I do this time. I'm fairly confident in my skills, if only because uh reasons. Go to sleep. <clears throat> should have max because I have max health. I should have max damage on all my weapons as well. Also that. Here we go! Now it's gonna suck if I end up losing this boss battle again out of sheer stupidity. It might not happen though. We are going to find out soon enough. Hi then, hi again, Blue Dragon.
Well, we already ate about a fourth of his health. I think we're doing pretty well, all things considered. Ow. Oh, so there is a maximum range on this gun. Who would have thought? The reason why I'm being so careless is because I know that the auto potion is going to activate. And I have a few potions this time. I know, it's a bad habit anyway, but... I kind of want to heal with this quickly, you know? Big Dick indeed is back in town. I have committed additional dragon genocide. And I am teabagging his face. Dragon side. Hmm, dragon scale. And this is already filled up, so we're gonna equip that. Feels good, man. Good feels, good feels all around. Wait, am I forgetting something? Can I go up there or ship? What if I had died just then? Wouldn't that just be a killjoy? We made it, fam. Look at all this cool shit I collected over the uh, course of this game. All these guns. All the guns. This thing just keeps evolving every time I visit it. 116. How much longer before at 150? How many more of these melee weapons do I need to use anyway? Lance. Alright. Ranged weapon now. Ra ranged weapon now. Uh, the Black Eagle. Sub weapon. I already got a sub weapon equipped, don't I? Yeah. Yeah, I got a sub weapon equipped. Cool, cool, cool. Don't need the lightning shoes anymore, so we can toss that or we can use it somewhere else or. Got the dragon scale in my inventory too. Even though I already got one over here. Lightning blip. My favorite rifle and sword. I'm assuming that in order to get unlock this bomb portion, we need to beat the next level. Which I can't currently do because I suck. <laughs> Let's see if we can go to get to your snowfield again. Actually, how many CCs do I have? Not many. 11. I can still increase melee attack, which is kind of necessary. I've been neglecting that a lot. I also need to put points into these things as well. Burn resistance, most likely. Let's see what we can see here first. Massacre. I love this gun. Sakata. We cannot build anything right right now, right? 
Okay. And do I have enough potions? How many potions do I got? I got two potions. There's no point in doing nothing. Play Snowland again. All right, all right. This okay. That ability is too strong. I if I keep using that, it's going to keep me from increasing my masteries of the other stuff. We need to put that away for now. Ooh! Ha ha ha! Look at this beauty. Is this a Yimmer? <laughs> is this the one with the giant slimes? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Insta killed. Oh, shit. Pew, pew. Look at all the guns and free shit. Some of these I've never seen before. Cool. Um, this one especially I've never seen before. Trying to get masteries on the Black M Eagle. More CCs to be had. That's a good start. You heard right. Flame land, what the fuck was that? Ow. Stupid ninja. Mm. <laughs> Learn the truth eventually. <laughs> I'll show you a truth eventually. Okay, I could stop using this gun now. Cool. Thanks. For nothing. I don't have any good guns to replace it with, though. It's except brass handgun. Ow. I'm gonna stab the shit out of you. This ice looks dangerous. Let's climb it. Said no one ever. I really like the music they got for the stage. It's a, uh, like, old school dub, I think. I could be wrong there. I just heard a noise of someone giving me food to eat. Thank you. Nom 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 Mm. Let me get a drink to eat with my pizza. Nom 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 nom. <sighs> pizza sure takes a long time to disintegrate, though. After, in spite of my Attempts to hurry. Num 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 num. Um, num 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 num. It, it's, it won't hold itself straight. One second. All right. Go. Just go into my mouth. Thank you. Oh no! Missiles. You just took out half my health, you asshole. My God. Free stuff. Woo! 
bitch. I will cut you. Thank you. <laughs> what in the world just happened? Why did that just happen? How did that just happen? That's a really long range for a spear, shit. Oh, man. I don't have time to fuck around with you guys. You're dead. You too are dead. <laughs> oh, shit. Did I die? Did it use up all my potions? It did not. Lol, stop, please. Don't nerf me. No, don't nerf me. Why would you nerf me? What did I ever do to you? <laughs> oh, I love it when a plan comes together. <laughs> no, I should have. I didn't get the item. Shit. Wow, this was really... That was actually very simple. Just then. I do need the opal core there. And I can finally replace this. Health is looking terrible. Let's sell some of this extra stuff that we don't need anymore. Like this gun, like these drones, like the hunter's quiver, Fabio shuriken, black eagle, fanatic missile, combat axe, you're gonna go ahead and equip the, no. Hmm. Equipped iron handgun. Alright, I think we're good. Hmm. Here we go. Risky Hill, be careful around here. Finally, we're going into a stage that doesn't that is kind of more rare than the others because the stages are like that. This move is kind of out. Kind of trash, isn't it? I wonder how many times I have to use the ultimate to get used to it. But it seems to be using being used up on its own. Oh, it actually does summon a dragon. What the hell? Mm-hmm. 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 Summons dragon. 
I'm summoning my blue eyes white dragon. Rar XT. Hey baby, do you want to see my blue eyes white dragon? One second, I need to charge to cool down on it. Oh, Q is already used up. Okay, we could switch that out for something nicer too. Something like... I, I don't have any good options actually. Shit. This one maybe? I'm gonna use the Yeezy instead. Yeezy game, Yeezy life. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, Jack? Am I moving faster? Oh, you bastard! How dare you! Ooh! I like this SMG. Thank you. Oh shit, why am I dying? Fuck off. Oh snap. Crackle and pop. Eats dragoned. The dragon missed, somehow. This game can get really intense looking sometimes. Like, oh shit. Yeah, there goes one of my potions. Fucking alien shitlords. You're dead. I said you're dead. Why are you back and not dead? Reload, reload, reload. That was the sound of my potions pop. I'm out of potions. Shit. This boss battle is going to be a pain in the ass. Oh, great. Car it's the uh, Sailor Scouts, or the Power Rangers, or... You, you get what I'm saying, right? Seriously? There we go. Mm, it does no damage. Sadly. How are we looking on the... Shit! Why does it take so long? What's this one here? 10% movement speed and 1 HP. I'll show you a dangerous formation. Hmm. Flame Spirit item acquired. Uh, I don't like Flame Spirit. Close. Sure, it's taking a while to get XP for that. <clears throat> like a really long while. Ruined military base. Is that a Gundam? This must be a new, uh, mission, a new, uh, map type that I have not visited yet. So I don't recognize it. Oh my god, they are Gundams. Ow. Health. I got Nano's potion. Ooh woo. I know, right? You guys have been seeing that for a while, haven't you? 
Yeah, check that out. Those Gundams. Ooh, secret shit. Aha! My piss droplets hit the... Er, what in the world is this? Where are we? Bruh. New lore drop. Yeah, I think so. Balasada. Relentlessly strikes your enemy with Ice Storm. This is a legendary uh, missile weapon. A support weapon. Is that it? Interesting. Oh man, this stage is so fun. Which is why we're going to skip everything. Am I right? What is this? Don't need all these fucking... Oh, I need to use these too, don't I? Yep. Reinforced whip. I don't need the sun boy. Defeat all remaining enemies. I'll defeat your enemies. Fuck off! Just casually whipping the shit out of these robots and stuff. Oh, god damn it. No black hole bomb for you, buddy. And that must be an iron gun. Which I already have plenty of. But we discard this. Yep, iron handgun. Okay, I know I scaled this before. There we go. When you run too fast, it's harder to control the dashing mechanic. Strangely enough. Oh, I remember this one. If I recall correctly- Oh, they made it so you can actually just press them now, too. That's very convenient. The awesome ice sword thing from before is here as well. No, I, this time I cheated and I know what the guide is. It's literally just pushing these four buttons repeatedly. So, so I'm not, I'm not getting stuck there again. Fuck that. Sell all our extras. Well, wait, wait, wait. What can we make first? Let's let's make some cool shit. Yeah, boy, making the alien parts. Let's transmutate stuff together. Place left. Place right. Synthesize. Place left. Plus right, synthesize. I've never seen this one before, sweeping lightning. Place left, place right, 
Is this new too? Wait, no. I already know what a black eagle is. Ice bomb. Ice, ice, baby. To keep using the whip until I grind that out. This is almost there. This is taking a while. Can you use this? Science lady has cute glasses. Yes, she does. <laughs> I'm really fond of round glasses. That's why I'm thinking about adding them to my model or this model as well. See what they look like. I also have glasses in real life, so that's, you know, a little bit of bias on my part. No. What's wrong? You made a character with round glasses recently, but you can't remember what for? What did you make her for? If I may ask, I mean, now. Gladrial stove with nothing of value. Yeah, sure. Sure. Nothing of value, my ass. Oh, this is maxed out already. Hmm. Defensive recovery. A nano potion. Eat shit, nerd. Oh my god, that was so cool. Eat shit, nerd. Wow. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Come on. Come on. Come on. Man, you suck at this. Come on. I can't get the timing down. Brickly. He just keeps getting gets keeps coming in close. 
Let's see what you got here, Ace. Oh. <laughs> She's cute. Oh. Resilia, huh? Area north of Dag. Whatever that means. Wow. Sometimes I really do question my decisions. Well, that works. Okay. What's up? Get dodged, nerd. Look at this edgelord. Oh, shit. He had brought friends. Oh! Bad. Christ almighty. Fuck off. Really? Ice ninjas. Ice. Ice ninjas. May have just wasted that ultimate. Yeah, I told. I actually just. I did. I did waste that ultimate shit. Ooh, what's over here? I know I shouldn't, but I want to. Fuck it. No, damn it. Once more. Once more. Once more. Once more. Woo! Aha! That was totally worth it. Me, I'll actually be able to beat the boss this time. In this uh, stage. Kid gloves are off, kid. Yeah, the kit. Uh, easy. We're only going to select weapons that will actually help us in this fight, which, which includes this one. Yeah, we'll keep the we'll keep the uh, gun log. Give me a pistol, a. Uh, Increases damage at 20 by 20% or relentlessly strikes your enemies with an ice storm. Yeah. Wave formation ha does more damage though. Super particle cannon can't miss. But this causes freeze on people that get hit. That's such a jank ass. Let's use this one. Thanks for Koopal. <laughs> 
I'm fairly, feeling fairly confident about this one, but you know, bad luck could strike at the worst moment. Thankfully, I do have a couple healing potions here left. Alright, let's boogie. Oh, I didn't know you can take a potion, a uh, potion hotkey. Was it always like that? Hmm. Alright, here we go. Hands aren't displaying properly, but I'm rubbing my hands together. Here we go! Hi again, asshole. Man, I really am just tearing this by tearing this guy apart, aren't I? Oh, I'm being torn apart too. What the fuck? Why am I- where am I even taking damage from? Oh, you're angry now, huh? What makes you think I'm gonna let you re-heal re like that? Fuck they- fuck that! Finish him! It didn't finish him, but this will. Is it just me, or did that seem easier than usual? Thank you! Yeah, that did seem unnecessarily easy. I almost feel bad. But I don't actually, but I'm not actually, I don't, no, 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 no. I don't actually feel bad. Fuck this boss. <laughs> cool. Let's see where we're... 124. We're going through this thing really fast. Tell you what. Once we reach 150 and we get all the legendary stuff, then we'll go to the volcano stage. Sound good? Mm-hmm. Very close. I can't wait. I have so much junk in my inventory, though. Hoggers. Yes, yes, indeed. Hoggers, indeed. Let's dump some of this stuff, though. Um, what am I dumping here? This thing, I figured out how this works, which is kind of cool. Yeah. Move on. Actually, yeah, don't need that. I got two of these synthesis. So for my next trick, equip this. Equip the flame lance. Equip this uh, shitty ice shard thing. I'll do. What, else, what am I going to put here now? Probably one of these things, actually. But this is only rare, which means I could always pick it up again later if I really need to. Yeah, happy 222. Happy 222. To Tamari. It's a blessed day. Hmm. 
Mm -hmm. They're just cool, I guess. Some people like the coolness of the dates. Whoa, 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 whoa. Check this out. Don't I have one of those? I do. Lightning shoes. Why is it... Why is it not letting me... I I thought I had these though. Like I should be able to use the face boots. How do I get the dragon claw? Because I got the lightning shoes. And I got the dragon scale. Should be available, right? Oh. Because it came from the armor armory, I can't use them. Damn it. Well, that's a killjoy. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna go purge this. Uh, purge this as well. Thanks for letting me know, by the way. I just toss the legendaries in my safety deposit box and transmute the rest, probably. So I already got one of these. I don't need more of those. Remain instead, put this. There we go. I think we're good with the rest. I already got the uh, creepy eyeball thing as well, so don't need one of those. See what else we can map green up and master before I leave. Unless I did all the weapons already. Did I do all the weapons? Or all the all melee melee weapons? I did. Huh. Get the blade of savior out then. We're gonna un going to unquit that. What about range weapons? What other range weapons do I need to do here? Cannonball. <laughs> is this what I think it is? It says semi-automatic handgun, but it sort of looks like a defender. wonder how far I can get with the uh, cannonball. Dragon Spear looks sweet.
Hmm. All right. Let's go ahead and transmute our stuff. And do transmute this with. Hmm. Yeah. Whoa! Fancy handgun. They already have. Damn it. I wonder if that's the handgun I need, though. I guess not. I need this awesome rifle there. A golden handgun, no less. Lightning storm, I need a shotgun, it looks like. Mysterious item with the moon fire. Did they just craft two of the same? God damn it. Well, I figured that would something like that would happen eventually. Yeah, crimson. That's boring. Another amethyst core. I don't think I've used this before. <clears throat> amethyst core, I think I have. Alright. <laughs> How many CCs did I get for that mission? 18. Cool. I need these though. Definitely gonna need reducing burn effects before I go to the next stage. Bully some Forestians one more time. Harpoon item acquired. Okay, we need to remove that again. How in the world am I going to use this harp? 300 damage? Oh my god. Okay. I'm a believer now. Three hundred freaking damage. Mm hmm. Cannonball is high, but I did not expect it to be that strong. How are you doing today, Recoupal? Oh, yes. Hello again. Groundbreaker. I don't need any of these things there right now, though. Except for the shuriken. Uh, buy the groundbreaker anyway. Fuck it. You're always doing fine. Well, I'm glad to hear it. <laughs> Haven't used groundbreaker in a while. Oh, it's a ranged weapon. I forgot about that.
Do you feel fine? I can't get over the fact that this cannonball does 300 damage now. Look at this shit. <laughs> Whoa, wait, 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 wait. I just realized, what if I equip the amethyst? Oh god, yes. Yes. <laughs> That's funny. Big balls. Yes, we have them. <laughs> I'm having too much fun with that. Oh boy. Here we go again. Trying to do shit. Let me hold him, King. Well, that this just makes this one and walk in the park. Okay. Shit. Damn it. No, I missed one! Shit! Stop missing! God damn- there we go. Super Particle Cannon acquired again, even though I already have a Super Particle Coin. Anyway, um... Cannonball... I wonder if the Flame Lance... Oh, so you have to hit them with the ranged attacks, okay. You would hold my balls, wouldn't you, Ace? Here we go again with this stage. The bane of my existings. Ow! See what I say? See what I mean? Ow! Ow! Shit! Ow! I always get caught by that one over there. Another Raiden item. I can I have dual Raidens in this game? <laughs> That's not broken at all. Dual Raidens for fun and profit. Energy missile acquired. I'm gonna sell some shit. I'll keep that around. Don't really need super particle cannon right now. Or this knife. I'm gonna keep the light katana so I can get a uh, thing later. These are just broken as shit. I'm gonna keep those around to fuck up the dragon. Okay. I'm feeling lucky. Let's go ahead and do the...
Ah! Wait. Found a niche use case for this weapon, after all. Pop, pop, goes the weasel. Thank you. Let's see what we're getting today. It's a purple box. Uh, basic handgun. Boring. Despite not playing this game for a while, I'm just making my way through it really fast. It can barely be called a bridge. An aerial bridge. I like the humor in this game, too. Fanatical missile acquired. Ow. Bet you don't feel so smart now, do you? How many more times must I kill people with these cannonballs? Seven... Ha! Uh, is this getting... Okay. I'm so glad the cannonball actually does decent damage and is not just like a mean weapon for the sake of being a mean. Do 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 do. Another moon beam, moon fire. Forest machinery. This stage fucks me up sometimes too. Ow! As as I was saying. Ow! Ow! Shit! God damn it! Ah! Get wrecked, nerds. For fuck's sake! No. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Steep restricted area. I, I, I totally meant to do that. He did 12, da un 12 unpreventable damage to me. How do you feel about that? I actually found a use for this weapon? I found a use for this? What is that? Oh, Yizzy. Ow. I thought I got the timing right, but I seem to be wrong. Here we go. Oh, thank heavens. Don't need to use this anymore. Or this. Which I can't switch out now because I got too much junk. Mm. Equip that. Wait, no, I still need to use that. And I need to use these. Which reduce my HP. I need a gun. I'll use this one because it needs to be used. Okay. That's true. Ah! Huh! 
How did that miss? You can hear the faint sound of lightning. Ah, my lightning. How about them apples? I'm just shitting out lightning swarms up in here. Metal chunk. Big chunkus. Big chunkus. Big. I will get. Oh boy. I don't know why my expression is not showing that I'm smiling really widely. There you go. That's what I. That's I was been looking for you. Banshee laser. So can I mix this with a different one? If only I didn't throw out all my particle cannons. Yes, you are the storm that has approached. One second.
I was not a weirdo. I was currently muted. I'm so bad. I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, so I need a lightning core. Right? So we'll need to... Yeah. Well, thanks for letting me know anyway. I appreciate that. Boom, we got the lightning cord device. Actually, this is cool too. I just need this thing the, to get the light sword. No, wait, that's a lightsaber, isn't it? Oh my god. Apparently, I, I'm i getting really close to making a lightsaber. <laughs> cool. Aurora Borealis? Or Holonade. There's so many cool weapons you can get here. Dragon helmet. Does a thousand damage shit. So many cool things I can unlock. The master gun. Master Emerald. Well, I guess it is in my... I guess it is my best interest to not die now. Since apparently... I have to keep all this shit. Go ahead and make a dim forge a dimensional blade, though. Do I need a dimensional blade? Let's just focus on not fucking this up. So I already got all this stuff. be a great way to end the uh, session today as well. Oh, fuck. We still have a ways to go. I better hurry up. Got a few minutes to finish this run. <laughs> Stay on time. Because your time is valuable and so is mine. And I don't mean to accidentally stay over by an hour or so, like sometimes. I also like to thank everyone once again for coming to my streams. Um, now that I have them regularly instead of just whenever the fuck. Really appreciate it. 
I hope you've been having a fun time as much as I, uh, having a fun time. I don't do this enough, but I would also like to shill our Discord, which I don't have Nightbot, so I can't just type Discord to uh, give you the link. Let me copy paste it after I finish up these indies. <laughs> Go to info here. Go here. And here we go. Anyway, back to the game. I'm on a time limit now. So I got stuff to do when we cannot afford to beat. Ow! Why did I do that? Cool, that's been used up. Mm-hmm, speedrun time. Whoa, this is cool. This weapon is disgustingly off. What the fuck? Like, wow. Nope. Nope. You're dead. Some traps are still laying around. Why are there traps everywhere anyway? Is the game going to explain that? So I sure as hell don't know. Um, is there anything else here that's not been... I have nothing against traps. Goodness knows, I know enough of them. Myself included, possibly. Is that a chili pepper? What's a random chili pepper doing there? Or an eggplant? Is there anything else here? No. <laughs> easy game, easy life. Awesome. This has been used up. Equip. I keep forgetting to use these things. I should probably be more proactive about using this. 
They do so little damage, though. Like, dang. Okay. It's gonna suck if I somehow die in this one. Still have a lot of crap here I need to use, that I need to make use of, huh? Well, it'll take some time after all. Another power fist. Don't need that. Ooh, new stuff. Flurry. That's interesting. Another basic gun. What the f What in the world is this? A shotgun? Hmm. 100 damage each. Incredibly small bullets and causes freezing. Yeah, we'll stick with this. Going to abuse the shit out of. All right, let's get ready to rumble. Mhm. Mm we'll go ahead and finish this up and call the session. The dragon has no chance, man. This is just disgustingly... Oh god. I can just sit here and fucking wail on him, and it's game over now. Double Raidens is disgustingly overpowered. Wow. <laughs> Double Raidens all across the sky. What is that, a new record? Got the heart to the Lightning Dragon, too. Alright. It is 8.06. I have to grab dinner, and it's a good three hours. Once again, thank you for coming to the stream. We are back to playing Metal Unit. I do apologize for what happened earlier uh, in the stream. Didn't expect to get so emotional over a video game. But I'll decide by Friday. Wait, no. Friday we already decide we're going to play VR, right? Okay, we'll do that. Um, no problem, Recupo. Thank you so much for coming back. I'm glad everyone enjoyed themselves. Uh, I did post a link to our Discord if y'all want to visit us and interact with us there. And have it. Wait, before we go, almost forgot. You can't. I cannot forget this. I need to raid someone tonight. Who shall be our victim this time? Who do we? Who's who's streaming right now? We got Murder Crumpet, MF Noah, da 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 da. da. Sanya Penguina, Nico Bunny, Artificial Validity, some Pandy Mies. I think we. Rated Pandy Mies once already. Janity, 
Trans warped, dude guy Joey, Taz the Menace, Scooby the Slime. Hmm. Dude guy Joey, I did not expect, or I met randomly through a Discord I was suggested to go to through Stry or for Strive. He recently also started streaming. He is not a VTuber, but. Um, he's a pretty cool guy. He was very proactive about playing, about um, helping me to promote myself on his personal server, which was very unexpected. So I would like to kind of pay the favor, pay back that a little bit. He is playing Apex Legends. That I, I am not very fond of battle royales, but I'm certain that he will make it entertaining for all y'all. So let's go ahead and raid him. What is going to be our raid message today? <laughs> All right, everyone, prepare the raid message. <laughs> How about this? Once everyone's got that cop let me know when everyone's got that copy pasted and we'll go ahead and head over. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. Mm -hmm. Oh nice. Let's use seal clubs instead. That's actually one that one's pretty cool. Well we'll be using this one now. Oh shit. Thank you. Alright everyone. Get ready. Three Two, one. Get you. Get you back, dude. You didn't have to do that. Uh, I guess, uh, welcome people. Uh, I'm Joey. I'm a uh, part time streamer, or not really part time. <laughs> not really part time. Nerd, fighting game guy, and a uh, terrible Apex player. But mainly 